Hello there, Conestantu. Ben from Bite Size Irish here. The west of Ireland is famous for its beautiful mountains, so I thought it'd be nice to learn how to say the word mountain and a couple of other associated words in Irish. So, the word for mountain in Irish is Schlieve. Schlieve. And again, Schlieve. I'm from Munster, and that's Munster pronunciation of the word. That's fine in Connacht too, but in Ulster, my Ulster pronunciation is patchy enough. They would say it's something like Schliau. Schliau. And again, Schliau. So that's the singular, Schliev. The plural, mountains, is Schleite. Schleite. And again, Schleite. So, mountain, mountains, Schleev, Schleite. What about hill, you say? Well, the Irish for hill is Knock. 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 And that's pronounced differently in Connacht and Ulster. The pronunciation in the Connacht and Ulster dialects is Crook. Crook. And again, Crook. The plural of Knook, hill to hills, is Knick. 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 And again, this would be pronounced in Connacht and Ulster as Crick. 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 So that word Knick or Crick brings us to a nice little shanakal or proverb in Irish. And this one is poignant in the context of Ireland's history of emigration. This one is the far away hills are green or the hills far away from us are green and in a way it kind of echoes the proverb in english the grass is always greener on the other side so if you listen now this is is glass eat na knick if vad wuin is glass eat na knick if vad wuin and one more time is glass eat na knick Evad Wuin. So we know that Schlieve means mountain and Knuck means hill. But when we look at how these terms are applied uh, in the names of actual hills and mountains, we'll see that it can be somewhat arbitrary. So in West Kerry, where I'm from, we have Knuck Brennan. Now that's one of the highest mountains in Ireland, and yet we find the word Knuck hill is being used in its actual name. So Knuck. Brennan. If we go a few miles to the southwest of Knuck Brennan, we have Schlievenuller. Now, Schlievenuller is considerably smaller. It's only the 419th tallest mountain in Ireland, and yet we find that the word Schlieve is being used in its name. A hop, skip, and a jump away from Schlievenuller, we have Kruach Vorhen. And this word Kruach means stack, so it's a mountain with a summit that's of a sort of pronounced conical shape. Kruach Vorhen, and the most famous Kruach in Ireland, of course, is Kruach Fodrig. That's a famous Christian pilgrimage site in County Mayo, associated with St. Patrick, the man, of course, who is famous for reputedly driving the snakes out of Ireland, though I don't think we ever had snakes in Ireland. And if we did, we haven't had them since the last Ice Age, roughly 10,000 years ago. But, you know, let's not let the truth get in the way of a good story. Okay, lesson over. Hope you enjoyed it. If you would like to incorporate a bit more Irish into your daily routine, then we have a great newsletter called Gael Gagach which means Irish every day. And you can sign up for that over at bitesize.irish. From me, Ben, till the next time, Slán go forward. Bye for now. Go to bitesize.irish and sign up for our Gael Gagach Law newsletter.